And bounce the story of two civil rights activists and sisters whose stories became a New York Times bestseller is coming to the stage. You could see it right here in Charlotte. Andrea Brown, the fundraising chair for the Queen City Metropolitan Chapter of the National Coalition of 100 Black Women, joining me live in the studio to tell us more about having our say. Andrea, it is nice to meet you. Very nice to be here. Uh, before we talk about the play, let's talk about the book really quickly in case people aren't familiar. This is uh, the story of the Delaney sisters, Correct. right? Correct. So tell us a little bit more about the background of the book. Yes, um, having our say, a conversation with the Delaney sisters, the first 100 years, kind of gives a little bit of a brief overview of Sadie and Bessie Delaney, mm -hmm. who both lived to be over 100 years old, and that's just kind of unheard of right. these days. So um, they were pioneers in civil rights activists mm -hmm. and didn't really feel comfortable with things that were going on in the South and decided to move north to, to Harlem, New York. And um, one of them, Sadie, was lived to be 109, and Bessie lived to be 104 years old. Mm, so and they've got so much history and stories to tell. I'm absolutely, sure that are in that book. absolutely, absolutely. Okay. So what uh, made folks say, okay, let's let's bring this to the stage? Absolutely. Well, um, Sadie and Bessie, because they actually went to St. Augustine University in Raleigh, North Carolina, that kind of gave us an opportunity to say, let's do something here in the Charlotte area. Yeah. And um, this. This actually is the 20th year celebration of the book gone to Broadway. Wow, amazing, amazing. So folks are going to get a chance to see this book come alive, I guess, on stage in Charlotte, right? Absolutely, absolutely. The director of the play is one of our very own 100 Black Women. She oh. is the director, and she's actually going to star. And so that's kind of something that, that we're really excited about. What's her name? Her name is Dr. Corliss Hayes. Yeah. She is a communications instructor at Central Piedmont Community College. Uh -huh. So we're really, really excited about bringing this to life. What can people expect out of it? Is it a... Uh, a happy time because the civil rights uh, era, of course, there was a turbulent time. Absolutely. So what kind of a feel is this play going to bring? It's going to be a conversation. Okay. So it's an excerpt from the actual Broadway play. And it's going to be more informative okay. and people will have an opportunity to interact. Excellent. So it's going to be really, really exciting. Yeah, I'm sure there'll be a, a lot to say uh, and a lot for people to communicate about at this play. So when can people go and see this play on stage. The play is this Saturday mm -hmm. and it is going to be, we have two performances oh, at excellent. 1 o'clock and at 7 o'clock. It's going to be at Stage Door Theater at the Blumenthal Theater. Excellent. And uh, tickets still available for both times? Tickets are still available for both performances. Very few, so get them soon. Yes, get them soon and only $25. Exactly. I mean, that for a, a wonderful uh, moment and experience you can have there at Having Our Say. Thank you, Right. Andrea. Thanks so much for having us. Sounds like a wonderful Wonderful thing. Okay, we'll be right back after this break. You're watching WBTV News this morning on Bounce.